Mississippi to get ready for some SEC That's because the Crimson Tide of Alabama have made their way over for an SEC West showdown between the Rebels and the Crimson Tide. Should be a lot of fun today. Alabama comes in after a win over Houston to make their record 4-2. Ole Miss picks up a win over Louisiana Tech. They are now 2-4 on the season as both clubs get back into SEC competition. Have over 60,000 on hand. The square, the famous square, downtown Oxford, packed with fans last night. Kickoff bobbled at the 25, picked up there by Jimmy Johns, and he will be shy of the 30-yard line by a couple of yards. Back in full tack after the after the walkthrough. <laughs> John Parker Wilson will hand it off to Terry Grant off the left side, out over the 40. That'll be a first down to the 40. Kinch to throw the football here with a four-wide package. John Parker gets hit as he throws, and the pass is caught. Down to the 41-yard line by Matt Cadell. The seat lines up to the left of John Parker Wilson on second down and 10. They'll swing it to Coffey. And Coffey breaks a tackle inside the 30. That'll be good enough for a first down. A gain of 12 on the play. Last week. Fresh set of downs for the tie. Four-man rush. Pass over the middle is caught. It's Cadell again. He's to the 20. A gain of about eight. Quick play. The line of scrimmage. Hand off to Coffey, and he'll get the first down. Yeah, the reason they go with a quick count there, Dave, is... Hand off right side. Glenn Coffey. Fumble! Loose football. Who's got it? They will say the Crimson in the SEC. Third down and goal. Wilson will throw to the 13-yard line. That'll be Cadell, but he obviously is well shy of the goal line, and that'll mean that he'll come in and attempt the field goal from 27 yards out. The right hash. It is up, and it is good. So a 13-play drive. Five-man front by the Tide. Ole Miss will work the right side. Then Jarvis Green Ellis to midfield. Still on his feet and buys himself five extra yards to the Alabama. Four Jarvis to get up the field. Bruce Hall in a tailback. Rebel pass is caught inside the 40 down to the 38 by Bruce Hall. Simeon can't play. Bruce Hall working down to the 30-yard line. A nine yard pickup. Indication tells us it'll be another one of those. Adams fires wide open. Tied in Robert Huff. He will take it inside the 15, down to the 14. That's three receivers. He will throw it over the middle. Touchdown, Rebels. It goes to Dexter McCluster. Good call, quarterback. Eight yards on the reception. A better call by Dan Warner. Offensive coordinator, they run a little cluster bunch look to the left side. Joshua Sheen in to attempt the point after. And he completes the package in defensively for the Rebels. Four-man rush. Here's Cadell. He will make the catch and pick up the first down at the 40. Just found a little hole in there. Didn't need much. Four receivers set. Three to the top. Wilson will throw here or attempt to throw. Swings it far side. Pass is caught. Nikita Stover with the grab. Close to the third down. And we'll say a long one. Short two. And off, off the left side. Terry Grant. Needed to get just over the 50. See where they. Alabama quickly to the line of scrimmage. Glenn Coffey in a tailback. Pressure comes. Wilson sees it. Hits D.J. Hall on the far side. That probably will be good enough for a first down. We'll Over the middle, pass is caught. Nice grab by Hall. Had to reach behind these opening drives for Alabama today. Here's Glenn Coffey off the right side. Sees a little seam. Takes it inside the 20. Down to the 17-yard line. We'll give third down and one. Nick Walker in motion. I don't know if he got it. 
There was a second and. And they will give him the first down. And that's part of what Glenn Coffey brings to the two. And off left side, Coffey trying to get the corner. He will tiptoe into the end zone. Touchdown, Alabama. Well, once again, the ability to run the ball on the edge, you have to seal the edge. And that all starts with and and Andre Smith. Fourth rushing touchdown for Glenn Coffey. Point after by Lee Tiffin is up and good. So Alabama, the action offense. This time they'll hand it off. Green Ellis, out over the 40, powers his way out to the 42-43 yard line. Boy, look what he wants to work offensively. Here comes some pressure. Set up a little screen in the middle. It goes to Bruce Hall. Hall will pick up the first down. Drop the football. They'll say he's down, however, at the 43 yard line. That'll be a gain of 15 and a first down for the Rebels. Well, that's us no low. He's doing a good job of that. Adams. He will scramble and slide down to the 36-yard line. Houston tied. Adams. The pattern pass is caught on the near side by Dexter McCluster. Picks up the first down. Kareem Jackson, the true threat after the timeout. Ole Miss will run it off the right side. Good job as Green Ellis first down at the 11-yard line. Brought down by Rashad and two yards on the ground already. Adams, pressure comes, throws it up for grabs in the corner. Batted around, incomplete. Whoa. Well, really not a very decent at the end of the game. 22-yard field goal on the 15th play of this drive. It is up. And it is good. Oh, Roy Upchurch checks in at tailback. His first action today. He'll get the handoff off the right side. Upchurch out over the 35 to the 38-yard line. Give him eight to the field. The sophomore at a Tallahassee floor. He'll get the handoff right side. First down and a lot more into Ole Miss territory at the 46-yard line. Quick hitter over the middle, pass caught by McCall, the tight end. He's down to the 30-yard line or close to it, and that's another out of the shot, get on third down. Looking to the far side, pass is caught. Keith Brown steps up to make the grab, his ninth. Glenn Coffey back in at tailback. Call sweep right side. They'll stretch it to the corner. Did he get in? No, they will mark him just outside the goal line. Rip. Quarterback sneak from John Parker Wilson. He stretches into the end zone. Touchdown, Alabama. His fourth rushing touchdown of the year. Well, when you have this good offensive line, Dave, this is a... It is up, and it is good, and Alabama a shot. Good protection, Adams fires again, and a big collision at midfield, and Shea Hodge holds on in that tailback. Adams, plenty of time, fired and picked off at the 40-yard line by Simeon Castile. He had the game-winning, game-saving interception against Houston last weekend. Comes up with a big flag and get a review. I don't think there's any question. You forget that they have the opportunity to, to challenge the call. You know, with every call in college football review, so often you forget it. Snap is good. Hold is good. Kick on the way. And he missed it again. So Ole Miss. And it's off the right side, Ben Jarvis Green Ellis. Out over the 40-yard line. We haven't had many. Two tight ends in the game on third and very short. Ben Jarvis Green Ellis. It's a foot race. Kareem Jackson chasing him down the three-yard line on a third down and one. Untouched for fifth. And Ole Miss both with seven. 
First and goal. Here's Adams scrambling. Pump fakes. Touchdown, Rebels. So quick off the ball, they're going to hard count him. Boy, he knew it. He knew it, too. The, the aggressiveness of Perry. Jerry got the best of him there. Here's Grant, left side. He's got a hole. Here goes Terry Grant. Down to the 25, down to the 24-yard line. A gaping hole off the left side. Dustin with it. was right. John Parker Wilson over the middle. D.J. Hall first down inside the 15. Kendrick Lewis drags him down. Today, an amazing number. The line up in the eye, here to the fullback, Coffee gets the handoff, lost the football, Ole Miss has it. Looked like Big Greg Hardy might have got his hand on it, or Ashley Palmer, one of the two coming in off the left side, Greg Hardy, the, line, the defensive end, comes in and, and rakes the ball out as Coffee looks like he's going to skate into the end zone. He got the left hand in there to strip it out. Could not get the block. Actually beat the tight end across his face. Arch, that's his second forced fumble today. Third of the year. And John Tom now inside the five. They'll work out of the eye and throw it. Going up top. Looking for some of that speed. Pass is caught. Out of bounds at the 45-yard line. Six on the 48. Adams plenty of time. Going up top. Pass is caught. On the left side. Down goes Adams at the 18-yard line. Wallace Gilberry just caved it in and picks up on the way from Joshua Sheen. He's 7 out of 10 this year. And that is no good. So both kickers have missed. Ultimately, you got to have some points. That's deflating a little bit. Free play. Wilson over the middle. Here's D.J. Hall into Ole Miss territory. At the 35, down to the 33-yard line. Kendrick Lewis and Cassius Ball. When it's crunch time, he's going to be the guy getting the ball. By the way, the man offsides for Ray Jerry moments ago. Pretty good day. Here's pressure coming, and Adams gets it away. Out to the 45 goes McCluster. That'll be a first. Second down and seven. Here comes some pressure. Castillo off the corner. Adams going up top. Lobbed in the air and intercepted at the 15-yard line. Picked off by Rashad Johnson, the junior out of Sullivan, Alabama. His fourth interception of the year. X. Here's a big third and three. Alabama's been great at third downs today, and it continues. And where do they go? But number 22, D.J. Hall, out over the coffee and running back. Here comes some heat. A lot of it. Pass over thrown. That'll bring up a fourth down. First punt today by either team. It's blocked! Ole Miss will have it inside the 10. Dustin moves on. The special teams stop. The ball. Absolutely. But they're going to throw it. Adams, they're looking for the end zone. A different guy, Michael Hicks, his first play of the, of the game, really, but just one more in the arsenal. That point after is up and good. I said I wanted the points. <laughs> Wilson dropped at the 22-yard line by 86. Now the Rebels will line up on third down. 
And three. They'll throw for it and won't get it. Big hit from the corner on Bruce Hall. Or excuse me, the safety was shot in the third quarter. Wilson has time. Steps up. Fires. Caught by D.J. Hall. Boy, that was good fluid motion by Jonathan. By Javier Arenas averaging over 13 yards per punt return. Third in the SEC. This is a good kick. Arenas will take it at the 25. He's got plenty of room. Look at Arenas go. Javier Arenas to the 30. Dropped at the 23 yard line. And the tide are in. Have close football games, it seems like. Great footwork by Terry Green. He's inside the five. Down to the three-yard line. Out of the eye. Grant, your tailback. He'll get the handoff. Bounces it outside. Touchdown. Crimson tie. Came with the G play to the left side. Antoine Caldwell. I don't know what is. One after up and good from Lee Tiffin. Six to go. Castillo on a corner blitz. It's picked up. Adams fires over the middle, and this one is picked off. Ezekiel Knight. Touchdown, Alabama. They will mark it. It appears at the five-yard line, but Zeke Knight with the big pick. Marcus Carter gets the big hit, Dave, that jars it out. Seth Adams, it's a good throw over the middle, but it's in traffic, and you see the foot. Looking at a third and goal from the seven. Out of the shotgun, Wilson pump fakes. He's chased and has to throw it out of bounds. And who chased him down? I mean, this is one of those or not, Lee Tiffin from 24 it's on the way and this one is good and Alabama has retaken the lead Twenty right take a shot down the field for a first down and they had the first down but McCluster just dropped some games where there have been some uh, both teams and double figures in that department John Parker Wilson throwing it to DJ Hall pass is caught at the 15 just one out of six on third downs this half. They were eight out of nine in the first half. Pass is caught by McCoy inside the 10, but 26-yard attempt. He's made from 27 and 24. Lee Tiffin. It's a fake. And Ole Miss reads it. And Greg Hardy stepped up and made the play. This is a game like any other. Here it is, fourth down. Adams fires. Long pass. It's caught at the 28-yard line. First down, Rebels. Adams. Pass is caught. Mike Wallace near midfield out at the 48-yard. Third down. Pressure coming. Down goes Adams at the 45-yard line. 17 seconds. Adams going for it all. And intercepted. Caught. Caught inside the five-yard line. And Hodge just comes in and, and wins the battle. But will it be? They're still looking at it. Pin wagers down on the field. Our referee today, Doyle Jackson, our pin wagers to tell us what the story is. After review, the replay is being reversed. Video evidence shows the offensive receiver went out of bounds on his own. Came in with the first player to catch the ball. By rule, this is illegal touching. It was fourth down. The ball is changed over. Touchdown. down. 
Well, for the third consecutive year, Alabama will hold on, and it comes down to basically the final play of the game. They win it by three points, and all kinds of stuff, I guess you could say, is coming down from the stands, and uh, 